In this video, we are looking at a Wi-Fi signal centered around 2.4 gigahertz. Looking at the dynamic signal, it's often difficult to visualize. Adding a max hold trace will display the highest value that occurred at each frequency while we have been observing, in addition to the dynamic changes we see currently in yellow. To do this, we press the trace hard key. Next, we can select trace mode. From here, we can select max hold. Over time, this will hold the maximum amplitude at each frequency. From the max hold trace, you get an idea of the occupied bandwidth, aka how much frequency the signal takes up, or how wide the signal is, and the maximum amplitude. For a dynamic signal, it can be important to catch the worst case scenario with the highest amplitude to compare against EMC limits, for example. When you are finished, you can either preset the instrument or simply to remove the second green trace, hit blank.